Google is releasing a ton of updates on Google Photos, and one of the recent new updates is this aspect called the Magic Editor. So any photo that you that you take that gets uploaded to Google Photos, you now have the ability to go in and edit it using AI. Editing isn't like adding a ton of extra things to the photo, it's more optimizing it, whether it's reducing blur or removing certain features, erasing things, moving things slightly around just to make the photo a little bit better for you. Once you go to the app, what you want to do is select a photo that you want to edit. And at the bottom, you'll see there's a little section called the magic editor here. I recommend you click that and that's where all the magic starts to happen. One of the first things you can do is you can use your finger on your phone and you can select a certain section of the photo. And this is great, for example, in this of this image here, but I wanted to remove these people from my image. You can just kind of use the brush and go over them a few times and then you have the option to remove them and get them out of that photo that you truly love. It's also a ton of other default options, for example, because you see in this photo, the sky is a bit cloudy, a little bit overcast. There's an option now where you can just change it to become like a good day, a golden hour day or just a, a blue sky. And it gives you a few options here to play around with, but it's just a one click and suddenly the photo, be, like it changes, the sky changes. It's really, really cool. Another cool aspect which I love about this new update is you can also select certain areas so using the same thing before just brush over something and you can move them in the photo. So for example, I saw this sign in that same photo and I said, wait, I want to try moving this somewhere and I moved it to, to just a wooden pillar just to see what, how it would work. And it works quite forward to say, I love how it fills in where that sign was and places it somewhere else in the scene. I think this feature is really useful. If you take a photo of yourself or someone, maybe they're not, they're not quite centered up in the shot. You can kind of just drag and move them across so they're in the specific area that you want them to be. There's a ton of new stuff also in the future for Google Photos. The new Ask Photos option is currently up for waitlist, but you'd actually be able to use Gemini to ask about specific photos and what's in them after you take them. And I think it's a really cool new feature coming up. Uh, it's very exciting times for Google at the moment. Uh, they seem to have picked up some pace with uh, the release of so many features with Gemini, with gems, you can now speak to it in a much more intuitive way and I'm very excited to see what's coming up towards the end of the year for this Google Photos and here's the magic editor.